I'm meteorologist Adam Stiles. This is one of the cooler late May days we have seen. Temperatures today only getting into sort of the mid-12 degree mark. Not fun. We should be close to the mid-20s like they are in Windsor. So today's game of guess where the warm front is is pretty easy as it's all through southwestern Ontario. Meanwhile, the cooler air remains here for Toronto at 12 degrees, 13 in Peterborough, 14 degrees in Muskoka. And you can thank that east winds for a lot of that colder air. Plus, the air mass is cool, and that warm front is just down to our south. So that usually accentuates it just a touch. Now, what we're going to do during the day tomorrow is bring in a few rain showers as this system is just going to sneak a little bit further toward the north. There's going to be a piece of this that just brings us a couple of scattered showers as we head throughout the early morning hours. We'll see some low cloud cover and drizzle sticking around as we go throughout the overnight. But most of the stronger storms falling down to our south here tonight as they continue to deal with severe weather through parts of Ohio. Meanwhile, tomorrow morning, a little drizzly and a little wet to get things going. So we may see some minor delays on the roadway. Temperatures will be about 11 degrees. It's going to be light rain that we do see throughout the morning. Lingering showers, but starting to see some signs of clearing through midday and warmer temperatures. 14 degrees is what we're looking at through midday. And then in the afternoon, we go up to 19 degrees, which is still off the seasonal mark. But all in all, will be a nice afternoon. Winds look to be fairly light as well here in the city. It's going to be a little cooler near the lakeshore, though. As we go into the day on Thursday, we're up to 21 degrees. A few scattered showers. Southwestern Ontario could get a few scattered thunderstorms. We're going to get back to some sunshine and slightly cooler on Friday. Saturday, we're up to 20 degrees with a few of those earlier showers cooling down again on Sunday. Temperatures will be into the upper teens as we get into the first part of next week. But we do get back to some sunshine through the day on Monday and a partly cloudy sky into Tuesday of next week. The good news is for us in terms of seeing significant rain, that looks to be sort of out of the picture, although a few heavier downpours still possible in the Great Lakes watershed and into the Great Lakes drainage basin. So we'll keep an eye on that.